Oh, and today, temperatures were not very high for us. 91 degrees, our high temperature, the average high 96. So, temperatures were feeling much warmer than the actual high today of 91 degrees because of this all of the rain that worked its way on in. That rain really then tapered off into the early morning hours for the drive on into work. We saw some more showers then develop right around about 8, 9, 10 o'clock in our south counties, working their way down towards the south and east. In some spots, we did see as much as three to four inches. Of rain, two to three inches in this lighter blue color across parts of the Metroplex south of I 20. Not a whole lot of rain because it really was dying out as we went into the early morning hours. Uh, this So far this summer, we've seen a lot of rain. We're the third wettest summer on record so far this July. More than four inches of rain were up by 2.33. So far this summer, almost 13 inches of rain up by almost seven inches. And at the DFW Airport right now, we're sitting at 85 degrees, feeling like the low 90s. Uh, we're at 84 right now in Dallas, feeling like 90. Degrees and Fort Worth 86, feeling like 94. So across the Metroplex, mid 80s still holding on, on our way down to the low 80s to the upper 70s. So not cooling down too much more as we go through the remainder of the night tonight with mainly clear skies on the way. Tomorrow, we're going to be seeing a mix of sun and clouds, and then into the afternoon hours, very small rain chances, a few spotty showers possibly popping up for us. So we'll see our temperatures climb from 81 degrees up to 99. And we talked about that 99 degree temperature is going to feel like 105 to maybe 106, 107 in the afternoon hours. And that's why we do have a heat advisory in effect from noon tomorrow until Wednesday evening. At 8 o'clock. So that does include the Metroplex and North Texas County stretching up to the near the Red River. Thanks to this area of high pressure building its way on in. And you notice through the end of the week, we're back to 101 Thursday and Friday. So we're going to be heating up, rounding out this week. But this weekend, a weak cool front's on the way, possibly Saturday and Sunday. Rain chances 20 to 30 percent and temperatures cooling their way back down to the mid 90s. Doug and Kaylee.